So, right here, we're taking our uh, steering arm off, and then we're gonna take the spindle ball out and take the spindle off so we can replace our caster camera knuckles right here. And uh, we're just gonna do the same thing on the other side. And uh, we got our knuckle in here. So we got the red ones this time. So we gotta replace those because the bolts are stripped out on these ones right here. So we're replacing those. And also want to tell you guys that uh, we got our 358 back from Jeff Zimmerman over at Z-Man Racing Engines. We want to thank him for getting it back to us so quick. He said that he really enjoyed working on this motor. So uh, we're excited to see how she runs when we get her back in the modified. Dad's over here uh, putting the right side caster camber knuckle on. Uh, we ain't really got much else to do other than do it on this side and then put the rebuild kit on the carburetor. And now basically. So we got the new caster camber knuckles on. They're in the red anodized color. We got our hubs off. We're going to clean these up. Get all the dirt, grease, and grime out of those. Make those nice and clean. Uh, we got the new boot on on the carburetor. Uh, I forgot what else we did. I think that's basically it. Uh, just waiting for more parts to come in at this point. So... Uh, Today, we we're actually putting up a TV in the shop because it's dome season, y'all. Watching uh, Dirt in December. I'm oh! oh, oh, oh. oh. <laughs> well, y'all, we got the TV set up. We got Gordy Gundaker winning the race right here. And uh, those super late models. We got Logan Donzi, the driver of number 26. Demon, if you go watch our uh, new track take two video, you'll see his car. We got his dad, Wes, over there. Neighbor Mikey. Hunter Buddy Baron. Nathan. Ashley. Dad. Camden's girlfriend, Camden, and Shaven. We're all sitting back watching the dome, so uh, we'll see you guys in the main Super Late Model feature. What's up everybody? We're at the Dunsey shop watching Flow Racing, uh, third in December. They're uh, pretty sure they're wrapping up the B-Mans right now and about to start the features. So I'll probably video a little bit of the super late model main event, 30,000 to win for you guys. Well, we haven't even made a lap of the 40 lap A main event here at the Gateway Dirt Nationals. And uh, Shannon Bath the first cross us. So uh, we're going to race here and get going for
was a very interesting race. There we got Tyler Carpenter just won that race with a right rear flat, or it was going flat. I forgot to video it for you guys, but I couldn't because it was so. Now uh, Brandon Shepard, I he just. He went everywhere. He went from, I don't even know what position, up to fourth. But uh, we're about to listen to this Tyler Carpenter interview. So Brandon Shepard went from 13th to fourth. Uh, that I, He was so interesting to watch. He was on the high side most of the race. He was making his way up on Nick Hoffman. If he would have had a few more laps, he probably could have got Nick. So uh, I'll catch you guys in this interview. The helmet's off, and man, what a run. What a story to end the race. And getting ready to climb out of his aggressive graphics 28 car. All right, here we go. Tears flowing down here in victory lane from Tyler. He's got the in hand, Tyler. Let's take a look. The right rear going flat late in the race. Can you believe you hung on to win this race and standing here in victory lane? Not at all. You know, I just try to create a bunch of hype and be somebody that everybody wants to see. Dude, I'm in here again, you know? Hell, I don't know. I ain't even a crybaby, but how do you celebrate? <laughs> you talk about all the hardships you've battled through. A family of five trying to feed those kids. and You got a $30,000 check there. And you're going NASCAR truck racing. A kid from Parkersburg, West Virginia. How crazy is that? They don't know what they got yourself into, so I can say. <laughs> <laughs> and there's no race at Knoxville Raceway. You and I talked about that. Two gateway oh, donations. How cool that, that would be to race at Knoxville. And you look at this wheel and towards Victory Lane. How long is it going to take to sink in that two time champion and NASCAR so driver, Tyler like, Carpenter? In, he, it like, ain't going to sink in, I'll tell you why. Like, I don't think I'm supposed to be he's here. It himself. We're just forcing it to happen. You know, I love my family to death. I ain't saying we're freaking broke. I know you guys are tired of hearing it, but you just don't even really know. I beg for help. I beg for just to, somebody help me get better and make tracks. This is for my family, you know. I don't care how you see me. Trash, you know, people take me out. Rednecks, crackheads. I don't even care. I'm here to use the the one. How's that sound? I guess I'll let it take you on the way home. I'm just hey, I'm glad to be here, man. I'm glad you guys all buy my apparel. I'm glad I got the support I got. You know, haters are not all of all you guys. An old man is with me two years ago, Whiskers. He's been with me since I just gave big man. He's just a rough cut. You guys look back, bitch, you just see me as in a flannel. And he told me, I'm going to the dome with you and uh, we're going to win that thing again. You know, everybody toots your horn, but I'm not that type. I come in here scared to death, I wasn't even gonna make it. I didn't want to get in this thing with professional. That, that old man I was talking about, anyhow, he passed away because of COVID. And, you know, I loved him to death. You know, he wasn't, he wasn't some high class dude. He was just as real as it gets, a good old man. And uh, this is for him, this is for Fran. Manning, you know, I got Manning with me, all because all you guys, this little girl's still alive. You know, I can't thank all you guys enough, my family, my crew, sponsors. I can go on for days, man. Just read the car. I'm too troubled up to thank all you guys, but just know it's appreciated. St. Louis, let him hear you one more time. Tyler Carpenter. Here we are, you know, at the old number 26 garage here. We're talking to the old Colt Johnson, the old Goldilocks here. Uh, how was that uh, hot lap session? You got your car got a little tore up there in the hot lap. Yeah, I mean. $3,000 body on the thing, uh, like a $600 rack. We're not the first lap, totally 
really junk the thing. I mean, it was a good run. I'm glad I got invited in the old uh, b mod here. But I just didn't have anything to run with them boys up there. Thought if I made it look pretty, I might have got out to the front. But I guess I just did, didn't put my money where my mouth was or whatever. I don't even uh, know how. Apparently, I apparently not. I tried to like Tyler Carpenter with them, but he oh, yeah. on us. These are my exclusive Tyler Carpenters. Uh, the only ones made, got them off HeyDude.com. <laughs> Nobody else has them. These are the ones that uh, he got fined in. I uh, just got them shipped to me last night. Uh, they're signed right here on the bottom. Uh, anyways, yeah, I, I wore them too much. I just, I smelled the insoles and everything else. Wore, wore the bottom of them so I get to these yeah. tires and I got a little hot. Yeah, I mean, I threw an M60 somewhere on this thing. I think it was on that like left front right there. I don't know. Dude, they told me that if I was just packing it and I put an M60 on it, it didn't really matter. It's the only tire I had. You were hanging that fucker half the time. You know what I mean? Yeah, you, I mean, you didn't even I need mean, it. You I didn't broke, need it. I, I mean, I broke my rock through shot, so it just, it just started going. I, 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 I didn't really care, though. I just, like, stuck her in the wall, bent up the old right rear. Um, you know, got a bit my nine inch floater over there. Uh, broke my new Atco shocks. But, I mean, it was, oh, yeah, and I got to thank my sponsors up here. You see all these nine lock pants? Keep me on this old 26 B mom next year, old son. Because we all not we, we buy so we got, much. We got a little selection, a couple of twist keys and a, a Budweiser in there, and Nick Ultra in yeah. the slide. But, hey, we're open for options. Natural I'd be most preferred, obviously. Yeah. But, uh, what do you think about that? Can I see your ID? Uh, um. That's in the truck. Left in the truck. <laughs> <laughs> I would too. Anyway, appreciate the interview there. Go to lock. Hey, go up next time. All right, everyone. That's going to wrap up this video. Uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Uh, and I guess I'll see you guys on the next one. Seduces.